Hey guys, welcome to another video, and I'm recording like, uh, 11 something, I got no school tomorrow, so, yay. Uh, I'm showing some Lego Star Wars stuff, well, one thing that isn't Star Wars stuff, but first I'm gonna showcase, if you haven't seen, oh god, it's so dark, uh, I know you guys can't see, but here, oh. I really need to find a better place to record this kind of stuff. But here is the Lego Scout Trooper. God. Yeah. <laughs> I need a more lighting. Ah, uh, there you go. Yeah, it's sort of better. But this is the newer version. This is not like the old version. Where like the back didn't even have any printing. And uh, no leg printing. It was just like... Oh yeah, by the way, here's something... There's no face at the back, or no face at the front, because I actually swapped the head out with a plain black head, because here, let me go. I switched it off, and then, oh, wow, okay. Take it off, then. <laughs> um, so, here, yeah, I kind of took it off, and then put it on to uh, this character. Which was a Call of Duty Ghost character who I ordered, like, 3D printing and stuff. Yeah, too bad I can showcase it. But, yeah, there you go. You can see, like, the face and stuff. It's kind of mysterious because you can't see it. <laughs> At least not here, but, woo. But we're all here to just see it. And, obviously, the best part is the helmet. The helmet's pretty cool. Um, the helmet is the same as the older version of the Scout Trooper and the old Kashyyyk Trooper as well. Um, I still think the new Kashyyyk Trooper was pretty cool. I used to have, like, two... I, I had, like, a Kashyyyk Troopers battle pack. I don't know where it went, though. I had, like, two Kashyyyk Troopers and two S Scout Kashyyyk Troopers, or whatever they're called. And here's some Lego Custom custom minifigures I've made. So here's kind of like my custom bounty hunter. Um, I guess, right? It's kind of using that, you know, imperial... I don't know. But... Uh, and here's like... Uh, I forgot which set this was in, but this is definitely from Star Wars. Um, this is, like, the blaster up. Come on, yeah. And then here's, like, um, this jetpack is from Boba, um, not Boba Fett, um, Django Fett. Yeah, I used to have Django Fett. Uh, I don't know where he is again, and his jetpack was found. Uh, next is my custom Rebel. <laughs> if you see here, you see I used the Lego movie, you know, those robot kind of police guys. I used kind of that. I don't know why. It looks sort of out of place, but mm, kind of best I could find. And here's like my custom Jedi or whatever you want to call it. It's like sort of a mix between a pilot and stuff. And it has a blue lightsaber with the silver. Yeah. And here's my custom speeder. <laughs> Not really custom. So here I'm going to point out the things. These these are like the blasters on the side. And then this is like just decoration. Uh, here's like where the minifigure stands. So here I'm going to represent it with my uh, scout trooper. This thing is like, this thing, if you want to buy this on eBay, don't. Buy it on Bricklink. Just type in Bricklink into like Google or whatever. Um, so yeah. So this is like the quad rockets. Like imagine if there was like, uh, this is kind of like the moni monitor. And then like it monitors when like the rockets are ready. A little meter or something. And then, like, he blasts off and they're homing... They're, uh, homing quad rockets. And they're pretty cool. Not really. <laughs> I don't know why I said it was cool. But it fits in really well with this guy. Even though he does have to stand on like this. Or you can make him sit down. Um. You can make him sit down. 
so here let's see if we, yeah so you can make him sit down too but i but if you're gonna be like making speed chases or something this is kind of the way he would be sitting and like turn his head he's like, it's like that kind of stuff but yeah um i love the scout trooper I'm, like, totally obsessed with the Scout Trooper. I'm always searching on YouTube, like, Lego Scout Trooper or Star Wars Battle from Scout Trooper. He's just my favorite. I, I don't like the old one. The old one seems kind of bland and, and stuff. I love this one, though, because look at the back. Pretty cool. Got that leg, leg printing. And the, then again, I don't feel complete. I don't know why. Because I swapped it out with a um, full black head instead of the um, the other head. I don't know. I don't know. So, if you're planning to use this on the Scout Trooper, your best bet is to turn it this way. So, this is the front, but then you turn it on the back. Oh, oops. So, trying to make sure the face is facing the back, and boom. Or, if you don't mind the eyes popping out, you can do this. But then, I kind of like swapping it out with the full black head, because then I won't have to worry about, you know, I won't have to worry about a face every time. So, if you have a full black head, I recommend you swap it out. Because here is kind of good for if you want to make a, like, a soldier, like this kind of guy. I don't really use him, but... Yeah, so here's like my three custom minifigures. And then here's like my one non-custom, but it's still cool. And here's like my custom soldier. And here's my custom speeder. This, um... I don't know. So yeah, I hope you guys enjoy. If you did, like, oh god, <laughs> like the video and goodbye.